children, how are you guys doing? I hope your week is going well. We continue to learn from the life of Jesus and today's story is based on Luke chapter 2 verses 41 to 51 as well as the eighth chapter of the book Desire of Ages. We've titled today's story The Boy Jesus in Jerusalem. In Jewish culture the 12th year wait we all know Jesus was Jewish right? Yes! Well, I didn't know that. That's all right. We learn every day, and now you know. So, among the Jews, the twelfth year was the dividing line between childhood and youth. Once you pass the age of twelve, you are no longer considered a child, but a youth. On completing this year, a Hebrew boy was called a son of the law, and also a son of God. He was given special opportunities for religious instruction and was expected to participate in the sacred feasts and observances. There were three annual feasts at which the people of Israel were commanded to appear before the Lord at Jerusalem. Now, which feasts were they? Say them after me. The Passover. The Passover. The Pentecost. The Pentecost. And the Feast of the Tabernacles. And the Feast of Tabernacles. Good. Now, of the three, the Passover was the most largely attended. Excuse me, Aunt Chilo, but what is the Passover? Oh, I'm glad you asked. Story for another day. Please keep tuning in for story time every Thursday on our YouTube channel. We'll definitely talk about that soon, all right? Okay. Lovely. Back to our story for the day. Like all the faithful Israelites, Joseph and Mary went up every year to attend the Passover. People traveled from all over Palestine, and they came in their numbers. I want to imagine it looked like our camp meetings. And if you're coming from Galilee, like Jesus, that journey took several days. Remember, there were no cars back then. The women and aged men rode upon oxen or donkeys over the steep and rocky roads while the stronger men and youth traveled on foot. The travelers moved in a very big group for protection and for company. There were a lot of talking, singing, and laughing as they went along. Sound of feet and hooves moving, cows mooing, and excited voices. Then the song, we are marching over to Jerusalem in the background. Then at long last, after days and days of traveling, the big city with its high and towering buildings came into view. Jerusalem! And everyone joined in the joyous song. Our feet shall stand within thy gates, O Jerusalem. Jerusalem is built as a city that is compacted together. We that the tribes go up, the tribes of the Lord, to the testimonies of Israel to give thanks to the name of the Lord. For they are set thrones of judgment, the thrones of the house of David. Pray for the peace of Jerusalem. They shall prosper that love thee. Peace be within thy walls and prosperity within thy palaces. It is in this setting, boys and girls, that we find the boy Jesus in the city of Jerusalem for his very first Passover visit. 